What's up y'all, Alvin here. And today we're gonna do a quick unboxing and initial thoughts on this Traeger Ranger Smoker. First of all, as a quick disclaimer, gotta let y'all know, Traeger did send this to me for free, but they did not pay me or ask me in any way to give it a positive review. So this is my real thoughts. Now that we got that out of the way, let's get into it. First off, I gotta say that just lifting the box up onto the table, this thing is a lot heavier than I thought it would be. So this is not one of those lightweight tabletop propane grills. I've got one of those, it works great, but this thing seems a lot more serious than that. All right. Boom. <laughs> Whatever this is, extremely heavy. Oh, I think that is the the griddle. All right. Man, that's solid. Okay. Looks like this is the actual smoker itself. Let's see if I can get that thing out. Power cord. I don't know. May have to, uh, let's see. I'm not sure the best. All right. I think we got it. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Okay, so get all this plastic off. Don't worry, I'm gonna recycle it. That and the box. All right. Man, this thing is solid. Okay, so looks like we've got a couple of latches around front here. That is, we got uh, an instruction manual. Probably instructions, warranty, that type of stuff. Now, I have been using one of the larger Traeger smokers for a couple years, and I really like it. Uh, so I'm pretty excited to give this guy a try out. Just the regular grill. Drip tray. And this is, this is the drip tray. That catches all the juice and drains it to the outside of the smoker. All right. I'm assuming. here. Okay, looks like uh, I'm not 
Oh, so these are probably rubber feet to keep it from slipping. Uh, a screwdriver. That is the. That's the probe for your thermometer. The screwdriver, there's probably some parts in here that require that. This is the little uh, bucket that attaches to the drip tray. Catch all that grease. Ah, nice handle. I'm assuming that goes right there. And I bet that's what the screwdriver's for. And one more little piece. One more heavy piece. Ah, these are the actual legs. And I'm assuming those attach to the bottom somewhere. I will read the instructions and figure out how to put those on. I'm assuming legs. These are the bumpers, screws, and washers. So that's everything that comes in the box. Assembly seems fairly straightforward. All right, so the next thing is to put this bad boy together and then let's cook something in it. Now, part of the reason why I was interested in this particular model, like I said, I do have a larger Traeger that I've used for a few years. I really love it. But we recently bought a travel trailer, and I thought it would be nice to be able to take the smoker on the road with us. Hopefully you guys like that. If you do, give me a thumbs up. If you like the channel, subscribe to the channel. If you have any ideas for additional videos, please leave those in the comments, and I'll see you in the next one.